Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So we're gonna get right into it. This is a, you know, first impressions of Timu makeup. So I did get some uh, makeup off of Timu. So it's gonna be first impressions. So if this is what you're interested in, if it's what you like, go ahead, feel free to continue watching the video and we'll see how everything plays out. So I'm gonna go ahead and prime my lids real quick and then we'll get started here. All right, so I know I've been doing a lot of pinks and purples and blues and colors like that. So today I figured I would just go ahead and do something nude. Um, so this is called Nude Magical Langmani. Um, this is the palette here. So this is what we're gonna work with today. They do have a few, you know, neutrals and some shimmers in there. So we're gonna work with that today. And I'll probably just mix a few colors and see what we can create. So I'm just going to take these neutral shades here. I'm just gonna mix them, I always mix them, and just apply these on my lid. So it's looking about the same, kind of like a orangish brown type of color. Okay, so I'm not really noticing that much of, you know, I mean, it's pigmented, but it looks more like an orangish brown on me. Um, in the pan, it looks darker. As you can tell right here, it looks a little bit darker, but it's okay. They're pretty pigmented though, I must say that. I do like them. And then I'm about to just blend out these edges here and then probably apply some shimmer. All right, so I'm just going to take a couple of these shimmers here and just put them on the edge of my eye. So again, we're gonna dip and spray. Always dip and spray your shimmers if you want them to stick. Okay, so that's not really showing up that much, but let's try, let's put some more on there and see. All right, so the brush doesn't seem to be working when this happens and the brush isn't working, then you just take your finger. So I just take my ring finger, mix it in there, and then just apply it. Sometimes that works better. See, it's starting to pay off a little bit. And then we'll just go ahead and do the next side here. Putting a little bit more on this side because it needs to match with the other side here. Okay, so that's more of like a bronzy type of shimmer, but it looks pretty, I like it. Um, and then in the inner corner, I think I may go in with the, I'm just gonna go in with the gold, make it pop. Okay. 
Okay, so it doesn't look too bad. I mean, after all, the makeup is pretty cheap. It's pretty affordable, um, but it doesn't look too bad. I mean, you just gotta, you know, play with it and spray the shimmers down and I think you'll be all right. All right, so I'm gonna do this to the next eye. Just spray my brush. So I like it. It's pretty colors. It matches my, you know, it matches my shirt for the most part. This looks more of like a fall color to me. Um, I put on the eyeliner and then we'll do mascara. As you can tell, I'm trying to do my eyeliner now without pulling on my lids. I mean, even if I was to pull on my lids, you know, it doesn't matter. But just like your eyelid's going to get crinkly if you're putting on your eyeliner over it. So it really doesn't matter, you know. Everybody's going to age. It's going to happen, so. Do what works for you. And the eyeliner is pretty decent. I think I didn't pay any more than like probably $2 or something for it. So it's pretty decent. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and put on mascara and then I'm going to go ahead and put on lashes. Um, so this is their mascara. It's called Thick Beauty's Lash. Ultra Thick Mascara. So this is it right here. I'm going to go ahead and see what this is about. too bad not too bad I mean it says it's thick um personally I mean it's okay you guys gotta remember this is like two and three dollar stuff I mean it's okay um not too bad but me my favorite is hands down Essence Big Lash Mascara or Lash Princess, sorry. So I'm gonna put that on. All right, we'll move on to the next eye. The wand is pretty nice though. It does remind me of the one from Essence. Okay, so now playing with it, it seems like it's similar to Essence. I'm starting to see a little bit of thickness. Maybe I just had to dip the wand in there a little bit more for it to show. We'll see. But I'm just doing one coat because, again, we're putting on lashes. I said one coat and I just went over it twice. Okay, so the lashes are on. I don't know how I feel about them. They feel like really fake. But I mean, they're cute. I mean, they're cute. They definitely have a lot of volume to them. They're cute. We'll go ahead and proceed here. So now I'm going to go ahead and put on my facial primer and then we'll put on primer. It's just called Hydrating Dual Phase 
setting mist. So it's just in a red bottle here. So we're just gonna go ahead and prime the face here real quick. It has a really strong smell. It's a really strong smell. This is their primer called Zero Pores. So that's what we're gonna use today and see what happens. And then this is supposed to be their foundation, y'all. This right here is supposed to be their foundation. So this is the first impressions. I'm gonna go ahead and try it and we're gonna see what happens. And I know it's not my shade, but for the sake of the video, this is the first impressions. I put in my skin tone color on this and this is what I got. So I'm just gonna show you. So. So clearly this is not what it is. This is not what it is. We are wiping this off. They definitely, yeah, this is not a shade that I will be using. I don't know anybody that is this light. So we are going to wipe this off and we're going to try this again. But I wanted to show you guys, you know, they're not always, uh, some makeup companies, they're not always on point, you know what I'm saying, with their foundations and stuff. So I just wanted to show you. So this is a no-go. So I will be discarding that. I did get a concealer, but I think I'm gonna try and use this as a foundation if it's not too dark or anything like that. Let's see, so this is called, I don't even know, Truth Love. And this is what it looks like here, Truth Love. But it even looks dark, it looks dark in the tube. So we'll see how this goes, so let's see. Okay, now this, this ain't cute. This, this is way too dark. As you can see, I cannot use this. There's, there's no way I'm not that dark. So I'm going to have to take this off and I am going to put on a different foundation and a different concealer. I do apologize. This is a fail. I'm not going to use that. I am not that dark. <laughs> so I'm going to take this off. All right, so I will be back and we will try. I have a bronzer blush highlight. Uh, we'll try that. So I, would, I do apologize. I'm gonna just do my face real quick and I'll be right back, okay? All right, so I went ahead and put on my um, foundation and concealer. I, there was no way I was gonna come up in here looking two tone like that. So, and then they do have a setting powder. Um, so this is called Giacomo. And this is then, it says honey. So it's a honey powder. Um, so we're gonna try this today. We're gonna use this as a setting powder here. This is the color of it here. So it's like translucent. It says it's honey, but it looks more translucent to me. So I'm just gonna go ahead and set under my eyes because I did go ahead and put my concealer on underneath there. So I'm just gonna go ahead and set under my eyes here. And I'm just using a Real Techniques uh, brush, a setting brush here. I think I just dab myself in the eye. All right, so there's that. I'm just taking a little e.l.f. brush, powder brush. I'm just gonna set my face here. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and do bronzer, blush, and highlight. Um, this is the bronzer, it's called Romantic Flower 2-in-1 Powder. So this is what it looks like here. It's pretty neat, it has a duo um, bronzer in here, if I can get it open. So you have this one here, and then there's another shade behind it. 
So I'm just gonna go ahead and use this here. And I don't think you can really see this on my skin. It's kind of light. This is the darkest shade they had in a bronzer, but I can't really see it, but it's there. It's more of a skin tone than bronzing shade. So there's that. And then the blush, they didn't have much selection that I thought would fit me, but this is a, this is the blush color. It's pretty, I like it, the pink. And this one is in shade, I don't even see the shade. So I don't see the name on it. So we'll go ahead and use the blush brush. So here's this here. And yeah, you can't really see it on me, of course, but it's okay. I'm gonna keep going. This is just for the video. Now they do have some cute um, highlighters. I can't wait to open this up for you. It's called Everything Wins. Guys, I don't know if you can see the reflection on here, but this is too cute. The shimmer on it, I don't know if you can see it, but it is beautiful. So we're gonna go ahead and use that and see what it does. I have setting powder all over me. So I'm just gonna, we're just gonna dip into all three of them. Oh, that's pretty. You see that? I'll do the other side here. I will actually bring it, I'll um, put more on so you can see, just for the sake of the video. But that's really pretty. It's more like pink. And I'll put this on the next side. It's very pretty. And I always put like highlighter on top of my eye like up by my brow bone and then I think for today I'll put some um highlighter in between like in, right here in the front of my eye we're gonna try that today so I'm just gonna take this little brush here it's like a pencil brush and I'm just gonna dip in and just put some highlighter right here I actually wanna try and bring it up. I'm gonna spray my brush and see if it'll like pop a little bit more. There you go. So there's that. That's really pretty. I like that. And then I'm, I'm going to blend in some shadow at the bottom of my lash line. So we're going to do that. Let me find me a brush here. And I think I'm going to go in with this dark brown color here. We're gonna go ahead and do lower lashes real quick. This is kind of liquidy. I see the liquid coming out of the mascara itself. So this is, this is their lipstick. This one is called Sun Lipstick. What that means, I do not know. I know it's the name of the brand, but we'll see what color. It doesn't even say what, 
it says zero four. So I don't know what color it is, but we'll see what happens. I don't like it. If I wanted to do a pink look or something, then yeah. But these are neutrals that I have on my eyelids, so it doesn't really match, but it is a cute color. I may do it again in the next video. I did pick up a couple other palettes from Timu, um, and I'll show those to you here in just a moment. Ting Fi, it's a glam palette, um, but it has more, you know, pinks and purples and shimmers in it. So I'm gonna use those one day. And then I did pick up a pink palette. Um, so this is a pink palette. I can't, I don't know what it says, but these are some beautiful colors. I'm gonna use that as well, use these pink colors. I may do a, like a little Barbie look. I know that Barbie look was coming in and you know taking over. So I may do something in a pink palette. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me go ahead and set the face. All right, guys. So this is the completed look. Um, this is the Timu, Timu look. I will be having more reviews, um, so please look out for them. If you haven't subscribed already, please feel free to subscribe. Um, there will be more content loading here soon. And again, thank you for joining. Um, have a good day, and as always, stay blessed.